Welcome to this Deep Lizard series where we deliver bite-sized, practical, and intuitive explanations for the most common terms and concepts in the field of deep learning. I'm Mandy, and today's topic is artificial intelligence. Generally speaking, artificial intelligence, otherwise simply known as AI, is intelligence that is inhabited by a machine or a computer program rather than a natural biological life form. We may consider a machine or a program running inside of a machine to be artificially intelligent if it's able to perceive its environment and act accordingly in that environment in order to reach a specified goal. This is just one definition, but note there are many nuanced arguments and debates about the definition of AI and what exactly it takes for a machine to be considered artificially intelligent. As shown here, popular subfields of AI include the field of machine learning, as well as the more narrow field of deep learning. And deep learning is the focus of this series. The subfields of deep learning and machine learning each implement AI with their own types of learning algorithms. Today, AI is already widely implemented and in use across several applications and still has lots of room to grow and expand. Some popular use cases of AI include these that we've outlined here. One use case is object detection, like that used in self-driving cars, where the AI system within the car is able to identify the different objects within its field of view. Another use case is in game playing, where artificially intelligent agents have been trained to play certain games, including chess and Go, and this here, which is a screenshot of the Dota 2 video game, and these agents have been trained to play these games even better than humans. We also have recommendation systems like those used by YouTube or Netflix, which recommend to us which shows or videos to watch next. These are oftentimes using artificial intelligence underneath the hood to choose these videos that it recommends to us. These are just a few of the many AI applications already in use today.